one's explained it to you yet. Soon now, yes, only in a few days, this world will be swallowed up in chaos. The fourth great ninja war. It will be a battle for the tail beasts. But oh, don't worry. I won't kill the nine tails because I promise that you can strike the nine tails yourself. <laughs> Nonetheless, you have only just implanted those eyes. You should recuperate for a while. So I'm finally here. At last, my plans are about to come to fruition. It won't be long now. Chapter 5 Plotting Behind the Scenes. It couldn't have been easy, but I'm glad you finally got control of the Ninetales Chakra. <laughs> of course he's happy that he can summon the Ninetales Chakra, but it seems to me that meeting his mother was of even greater benefit to Naruto. You got the Ninetales Chakra without losing it. Now the problem is how are you going to go about using it? I stored the Ninetales Chakra in a different place within me so that I'm not using it all the time. I tap into the Nigel's chakra when I need it, and it makes me more powerful. <laughs> like this. This is... A quick power-up with the nine tails, sir! Huh? What is it? You really think you're hidden? You're sensing some other chakra? Yeah. He senses another's presence that I didn't, was careless of it. I must do penance. It's not chakra. It's something else. Something coming from there. It's your blade. It appears you can sense hate and other negative emotions. You're Kotsky, the shark guy. But how? took you out a ways back. It was as simple as waiting for an opportunity during our battle to switch myself out for a cloak. The real me has always been with you in shark skin. What? In Mist Jutsu? Quite a bit of intel on the Ninja Alliance. I'm very grateful. <laughs> Is he trying to escape with that information? No way you're getting away. <laughs> a waterfall of truth? Not the toad headed for a place that dangerous? <laughs> yes. I cannot ignore a young man struggling so during the springtime of his youth. I'm gonna be my Naruto son! This man can be a bit over the top. Sorry. It's alright. Let's go, Aoba! Uh, so I guess I'm going to. Is this the waterfall of truth? According to the myth, if you sit here and close your eyes, you meet your true self. How about it? Why don't you give it a try, guy? You fool! Helping Naruto is more important! It, you don't have to get so mad. Ah. Or are you just afraid to face your true self? Hmm? <laughs> what? You think I'm scared? No way! Fine, then I'll show you. And I'll show you my spirit that fears no man. Huh? 
<laughs> what is this? Who is this person? This this weirdo is my true. No, look closely. He's a Kutsky. I think his name is Kisame Hoshigaki. Kisame Hoshigaki. I never thought I would meet you in a place like this. My beast. Hmm. Where have I seen this shark face? Would you mind please moving out of the way? Guys, don't let him escape! What are you doing here, Akatsuki? You really expect me to tell you? In any event, I cannot allow you to escape. <laughs> Very well. I was thinking it was about time I did something about the bond between us. Let me slice you up with my great sword, shark skin. I see. You can really fight. But I am a noble blue beast, and I won't fall behind a mere shark! It's over. I win. <laughs> You really are an odd beast. A ninja this skilled in taijutsu is rare. It's our third battle, and yet I never thought I would taste such defeat. Well, though you seem not to remember me yet again. Guy, did you take him down? You're amazing, Bushier Brow Sensei! You really took him down! Please capture him alive! I'll read his memories and extract the intel. So there's a member of a Hidden Leaf Intel unit here. Okay, I'll restrain him. I'll help you! <clears throat> you can still move. Be careful. He's gonna try something. It looks like there's no escape for me this time. But I must deliver this intel. Oh, that was close. One last futile struggle. And now I guess my part in this is finally. Itachi. We are partners from this day on. I am Kisame Hoshigaki, formerly of the Hidden Mist. I am one of the seven ninja swordsmen. Pleased to meet you, Itachi Uchiha. I've heard rumors about you, that you killed all of your fellow Uchiha clansmen. Murdering your own clan is quite the feeling, don't you think? I'm in the same situation. I understand how you felt, Itachi. You talk a lot. <laughs> I know that. Let's be friends and have some fun, shall we? And who has ever raised their hand against their own brethren never dies a decent death. So prepare yourself. Which means you and I are both depraved. No. No matter who you are, you don't know the kind of man you are until the very end. One realizes one's true nature at the moment of death. Don't you think that's what death is about? Itachi, in the end, it seems that I was... Still trying to do something? Look out, everyone! A decent human, after all. Suicide bomb. So that was.
was a water clump? No, he didn't show any movement like that. He's probably real. To think that someone strong enough to be paired with Itachi could die such a death. But he died instead of giving up intel on his comrades. So I guess even some of the Akatsuki are loyal to their own. That was admirable. The measure of a ninja's life is determined by his manner of death. Kisume Oshigaki. I swear to remember you the rest of my life. Looks like you're not going to just tell me where you hid the Rinnegan. I mean, Nagato. I knew you would show up here sooner or later. One question. Why would such loyal members as you and Nagato betray me? Naruto Uzumaki. You think he's that worthy? He is the light. That's why we all can carry flowers of hope. <laughs> you show your fangs and stand against me, yet you still wear the robes of the Akatsuki. Yahiko founded the Akatsuki. These robes are a symbol of justice. We created them. They are not yours. And the Rinnegan is something that Rain Ninja Nagato awakened. Again, it doesn't belong to you. <laughs> you are mistaken on the two counts. Since you are about to die, I'll enlighten you. What? First, I encouraged and pushed Yahiko to form the Yokotsuki, and second, I was also the one who gave Nagato the Rinnegan. What? So perhaps it would be more correct for me to ask for it back. But never mind. In my opinion, you're just an ignorant little girl who knows the location of Nagato's Rinnegan. Once I capture you, I'll have my way. Do not mock Uchiha's visual prowess. What you're saying isn't true, of course. It doesn't deserve to be heard. Up until this point, I have walked my own road. And so have Nagato and Yahiko. And you are not there. What the three of us have seen together, that is the truth. None of that matters now. In any case, your paths will end here. The path will not end. I won't let it end. I'll show you. We'll walk the path to peace to the end. Very well. Then show me how you protect that path. Show it the Akatsuki way. By power. I didn't take you seriously enough. And come to think of it, you are a former Akatsuki member. But I will not be defeated. Not yet. How will you attack me now? I encouraged and pushed Yahiko to form the Akatsuki, and second, I was also the one who gave Nagato the Rinnegan. Yahiko and Nagato were both acting of their own free will. They were not your pawns. It doesn't matter what it looked like to you. They fought and died for their own reasons. They share that common will, and I will not let you interfere. <laughs> Those are just words. After all, you and Nagato were both taken in by Naruto's foolish dreams. To me, you are nothing more than clowns. There is no such thing as true peace, no such thing as hope. Nagato only believed in Naruto because he wanted to comfort his own pitiful self. There. There are no clouds. Among the people I believe in. Yahiko. Nagato. Their wills shall not be extinguished. I too believe in Naruto. And he is the bridge to peace. And I. I 
shall be his pillar. I've just used up the last of my chakra, but at least Mada is dead. Sage of the Six Paths. Oh. I'd love to stay here chattering with you, but I'm actually very busy. Conversation is over. When I have finished casting this Kenjutsu, you will be finished too. <laughs> Sorry to keep you waiting. Let's get started already! Yeah, okay. First, you gotta go into chakra mode. Then you'll go faster down the road. Right! So, what about after that? Next, get in step with the nine tails. Then, let's have a bout. Have a bout with you? I get it. It'll be easier to plan his future training once we verify just how powerful Naruto is now. That's it. Right. Get your spirits back. You're ready, and you got my respect. Show me just how amazing a Nine Tails chocolate can be, Naruto. Here we go. All right. That's enough. <sighs> This really is amazing, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, he's a real threat. That power surely is a deadly weapon. So, he's trained from here on. His fundamentals are satisfactory. If the enemy wasn't too bad, he could fight them okay. All right. However, your control is still too weak. An unexpected situation would end in defeat. What? I'm not good enough yet? So what do I have to do? That's what I'm gonna teach you. The end of your training is coming soon. Yeah! Come with me. We'll do your training over here. Over here? You mean all the way inside the waterfall? The falls is like a wall of chakra separation. It's a great way to keep your concentration. Oh, I get it now. All right, so let's go, let's go with no fear. Yes! Huh? Captain Yamato isn't coming? That's right. The rest of the training is up to you two. You don't need my power anymore. It's going to be difficult to control the Nine Tails chakra, but do your best. You got it! Thanks! As long as he's in that place cut off from other chakra, Naruto shouldn't sense anything about the war. I'm sorry. You'll have to stay there for a while, Naruto. According to the information Kisame sent, Naruto is here. Now then. Huh? Well, are you finally awake? Who are you? My 
name is Kabuto Yakushi. I had you brought back here for my own reasons. Brought back? Ah, so that's it. <laughs> You're pretty good for a lanky weakling. It's helpful for you to understand quickly. Well, it's pretty helpful for me, too. After all, now I can start working on my ultimate art again, after being so rudely interrupted. <laughs> so, what exactly was the reason you had for calling me here? Well, the Eight and Nine Tails are actually on this island. I want your cooperation in capturing them. The Nine Tails? You mean Naruto, don't you? But, we don't yet have their exact location. And there are some troublesome ninja nearby. Brother Deidre! Your timing's been so good, you have to be doing this on purpose. I see. That is indeed a bothersome face. It is you, the real Brother Deidre! If you two are here, that means... It's been a long time, Deidre. Like I thought, you're here. I'm impressed that you were able to sense our movements. Kisame, was it? Yes. I heard about his invasion. I had heard that he was finally annihilated, but I had a feeling that was too good to be true. If he managed to succeed in leaking the information, we've been on patrol, keeping an eye out just in case. I expect no less from the Tsuchikage. You possess excellent intuition. <laughs> You lived a pointlessly long life. That's the only reason you're so sharp. Hm. But why? You died in a huge explosion. How come you're still alive? Did you perhaps not die after all? <laughs> he just looks like he's back to life because of the reanimation jutsu. I can't believe you're even causing trouble in death. Shut up! Death is one thing, but you're a mortal enemy who has always mocked and insulted my art. Now I will finally avenge myself upon you. Hm. Anyway, to continue our conversation from earlier, Deidara, you are... You don't have to tell me. I'll take care of them. This will be the perfect exercise to wake me up. <sighs> then I will leave them up to you. I will concentrate on hunting the Jinchuriki. Right, but leave Naruto for me. I'll be the one to deal with him. That's how it'll be. If you want to chase him down, you'll have to defeat me. So, you're getting in my way even after death. I am shocked by your stupidity. Huh? Either. I'm sure you haven't forgotten how terrifying I can be. And if you think I'm still the way I was back then, you're in for a world of pain. Krotsuchi, Akatsuchi, will crush this little punk in one fell swoop. Follow me! <laughs> you may pretend to be tough, but you can't compare to me. What are you talking about? The real fight starts... Huh? Where'd Korotsuchi go? So you finally noticed. You really are still an immature punk. Why, you... Playtime is almost over, Degara. That's my line! Ha! Persistent, aren't you? I won't let you get away! It's time for you to pay, you snake! Where? Uh, Aoba too, huh? That voice... It can't be... Kabuto Yakushi? It's been a long time, Yamato. So, you've come crawling out. You're late. You're the Tsuchikage's granddaughter, aren't you? Perfect. Now you will all take me to where Naruto is. Fool, it's just the opposite. We will capture you, and you will take us to the enemy hideout. 
Oh my. I'll have to watch out then. Alba, go make sure there aren't any more of them around. She and I will take down Kabuto. Right! Don't fall behind. I'm not taking time to fight him, so keep up! So much punishment. Yamato! His arrogance was his downfall. I'm taking Yamato. Damn him! He's got to still be in the area. Did you find anything? No. For heaven's sake, why did it turn out like this? You let him get away. Yeah, and he took the Woodstyle user Yamato with him. And what about you? I don't get it. He disappeared so suddenly. Daedara was nothing but a diversion. When he finished playing his part, Kabuto probably just released the Jutsu. <sighs> At least he didn't go after the Eight Tails and Nine Tails. It's hard to tell whether he was looking for any hostage to interrogate or wanted that Woodstyle user in particular. But either way, we'll have to worry about an intel leak. Master Yamato is not that easily broken, sir. That's not the issue. He's up against Madara, he of the powerful visual jutsu. No matter how strong Yamato's will, it's no match. No way. I see. So Yamato. I never imagined he would take another ninja instead of going for the Nine Tails. Still, we can't do anything as we are now. Well, we'll just have to get him back later. We know the rough location. Isn't that right, Lady Tsunade? What do you mean? Ah, that's right. You were never told. The other day, we received information that our recon unit had discovered their hideout. Really? The X marks the enemy's hideout. It's in the mountain graveyard. From here, we would have to pass through the hidden steam village and the hidden frost village, but... Yes. Because of that, we have already advised both nations to evacuate. I see. And what about our own preparations? We've already summoned the commando unit and assembled the main battle regiment. The same goes for the medical, intel, and sensory units. The Ninja Alliance can move immediately. So that means we are ready. Tsuchikage, I believe these are yours. Ah, they are finished already? Oh, so these will be our Allied Force hitmans, huh? Hey, nice job. Thank you, I designed them. You may have squabbled in the past, but right now you are one. Simply ninja. And this time, samurai shall team up with ninja. Now, let's get to work. In the fourth great ninja war, we will be victorious. Yes! Anxiety scorches the era. The sky will shudder. Silence will fall. And humanity will feel that war is coming. To meet the approaching threat, the ninja will rise up. With bravery and evil. With hope and death. It is time to battle. It is time to begin war.